So we've seen how you can turn a very big number into standard form, a much simpler way of being able to use it for things like calculations, but what about something very small? Well, let's look at something that we all have inside of us. Let's look at a red blood cell. Now, a red blood cell is just 0 0.000008 meters big. And again, way too many zeros for scientists to be happy with. So we need to convert this into standard form. But this time, because we are taking a very small number and effectively scaling it up in the form of 1 to 9 times 10 to the power of something, we're going to be moving the decimal place to the right. So here's our decimal. And we're going to count how many places to the right it has to move. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it's moved 6 places to the right. So it's moved 6 lots of a magnitude. Okay, or 6 lots of multiplying by 10. And because we're going to be making it as a very, very small number, we use a minus sign to signify that. So when you're trying to put a very small number with lots of zeros before your integer, then you just count how many decimal places you're shifting to the right and stick a minus sign before it.